Okay, folks. So, remember the last time I talked about the truck? My wheel was falling off. Now my wheel ain't falling off and I just cleaned it. And boy, does she need to be painted. And honestly, I can't make my mind up on what I want to paint it. Because I like the flat black because it hides all the shit. Like, this bitch is not clean. It is not straight. It's it's 80% there, okay? And people be like, oh, why don't you just do some more body work to it? No. Fuck body work. I fucking hate body work, my guy. Anyway. So now I'm debating on what I should do next because I gotta still clean my windows. And, uh, they do the windows. Um, yeah, I gotta do the windows. Should probably clean out some of this trash in here. Um, and then what I really want to do is I want to take these, uh, these pieces down. Now I drop the headliner, put that sound detonant shit on the headliner. And then also I want to get the headliner recovered. But since this one is just fucking straight nothing, I feel like I could do this headliner. So I think I'm about to do that now. And I'll see y'all in a minute. All right, so I done dropped the headliner. As you can tell, my truck was red before. Oh. Uh, you can't, you can't see. Well, let me trip, let me plug it in. Plug the phone in. Uh, it won't, still won't let me use the flash when I'm in. When I got this thing plugged in. Anyway, you know. Oh my God! Let me. I'm falling out of this fucking truck. God damn it! God damn it! You fucking bitch. Anyway, so I'm gonna get me a rag. And some uh, reducer. And I'm going to wipe off all this dust and shit. And I'm going to fucking lay some of that. Uh, lay some of the. Sound detonator on there. Put some sound detonator on the roof. Sound detonator back here. Uh, up on the roof. We got the pieces right here. That speaker's going in the garbage. I didn't know it still had the factory Ford ones in the back. I got some uh, Pioneers in the front now. There's that guy. There's this guy. I'm not sure if I'm going to paint these or if they'll clean up. I don't know. But honestly, we might paint them with the vinyl. The vinyl and plastic paint. I'm missing one last piece. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? That's right there. Anyway. So we got all these pieces over here. I had to pull my truck off this uh, concrete so I can use the use the water hose. And scotch bright. I'm going to scotch bright all these up. Clean them up real good. Let me go get some paint. I'm just going to do spray cans. So I don't feel like cleaning the gun. Um... And then I'm going to get a black can. I'm going to do the screw heads. And put these in a cardboard box. And paint all the top of the screws. Because they look like shit. And then I'm going to do the um, the headliner too. But not today. That's just coming out. So I can put the sound detonant shit in there. And then I'll put the seat belts back on when I'm ready. But I, this shit's not going back together today. So. I'll let y'all know in a second. Alright. I haven't filmed for about two hours. We got the the truck is all finished. I put the sound detonant on the cab. I put it on the roof. Put it on the pillars that go next to the window, the windshield. Did back behind these little speaker covers and behind these panels. Just got done painting them. I think I might do one more coat. Because there's like shit that's popping through. But I mean, I don't know what... What the deal is with this paint. It goes on green and it dries gray. It's weird. Weird. Anyway. Um. It smells good. So yeah. So actually. Let me show you what I'm using. 
Duplicator. 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 Did you say that's the same color? Kinda. All right. I think so. Anyway, I'm about ready to go home. I'm tired. It's almost seven o'clock. Had to come in tomorrow and work on this fucking bedside. It's all crushed. It's fuck. All right, guys. So I'm back. I got this headliner. All that shit on the floor. That's all the foam that was on it. I used um, used that grinder. Just ground off all the ground. The the foam. If you touch the foam, it would fall off. So, but that just made it easier. Anyway, so let me show you what I got. Little deer. A bunch of little deer. Just hanging out. Now, so, um... I watched a video earlier on how to do this. I don't know how to do it, but I watched a video on it. And it says to do it like halfway. So you spray all, spray this thing, spray that. Then wait five minutes for it to tack up and then flip it over and then do it again. So let me try that and I'll see if it works or not works. All right, so <clears throat> I got it all headlined. Um, it looks wrinkly, because it is, especially in this middle area. Me and my boss started putting it down. Um, my boss came out here just to help me. Honestly, I feel like I could have gotten it less wrinkly before he started helping, but then that shit was irritating to me. I don't like that shit at all. Anyway, you can't see the wrinkles in it when you don't look at it. I mean, no, you can't fucking see the wrinkles at all in it right now. It's fucking camouflage. Can't see shit. You can't see Jack Dick. Except for when you get into the three-dimensional world. But, like, all this side? It's pretty smooth. There's a wrinkle right there. The little one right there. But honestly, it's uh, it's for a fucking truck, who cares? So, but I got my little hole cut out for the light. Uh, I think that's all I gotta cut out, really. I think there might be a little, a little spot right here. But I'll just sit and screw through that fucker. Anyway, about to put it in so I can put my little pieces in, these pieces that I painted the other day. I put those in. They're covered in fucking dust. Uh, but anyway, I'll catch y'all back in a minute when I do that. All right, folks. Um, hold on, let me actually. Now you can see the color difference between the the dashboard and that shit. Don't mind the door panels because them things are them are ugly. So this is the the fabric spray shit from the auto parts store I'm gonna get I got this can right here but like I said it doesn't spray so I need to go get um, need to go return this one and get another one but there's a couple spots where my hands are dirty and it fucking put marks on it and it really pissed me off and then look at the freaking headliner they look pretty good up in here can't see none of the fucking wrinkles in it. There's a wrinkle right there. Can't see it on, on the picture. You fuck, you can barely see them in real life. Anyway. So now I got... I got these. This is the only thing left I got to put in there. Is the visors. But I kind of don't want to put the visors in there. Then I don't want to just spray the visors with that paint because obviously I don't have enough I gotta get another can 
But then I was also thinking about wrapping them. But then, like, if I wrap it, I have to. No, that ain't gonna, I ain't gonna wrap it. That'll look like shit. I'd rather, if I wrapped it, take the the fabric home, measure it, make this freaking just a little bit smaller, and sew a line into it, sew it like an envelope, so then you can just, or no, like a pillowcase. That would be a better term of reference, so you can figure out what I'm talking about. Have it like a pillowcase. And just fucking put it on there. And then, I don't know, that wouldn't even work either, because it's fucking stupid. Anyway. Huh, I'm going to put those back in, because uh, I just drove to the bank a minute ago. God damn, I got a fucking eye cancer now. I can't see shit. I done looked in the sun for too long. I fucking hate that bumper. That shit. Fucking ugly. Ugly bumper. Ugly grill. Ugly headlight surrounds. So let me tell you what I want up here. I want the 2008 to 2010 F250 bumper. The 6.4 bumper. Because that one, I feel like that one looks the best. The best. Like the new 2020 bumpers on here. Those things look fucking sick. Sick. But my truck ain't got that. Like, I feel like you gotta have... The big wheels, the big lift, all the LEDs to have the 2020 bumper. Ain't got none of that shit, so I'm going to stick with the chrome. Just the chrome bumper from the 08 truck. And because I feel like that one looks more classier. Because it's just straight chrome and then a top trim black piece where you step on and shit up here. But uh, the new one is... The new new one has just got too much shit. It's got like fucking bezels for the fog light holes. It's got fucking bezels for all the shit in the middle. Yeah, fuck all that. But I like this truck. It ain't too bad. Battery's dying. Flashlight. Too low. Anyway. So just letting y'all get the update. Oof. Freaking noise. Freaking noise, yeah. Alright. Alright. So I got... I got the visors in. I didn't paint them. Didn't do anything. I just cleaned them off. With a scotch bright pad. I mean, honestly, you can't really tell. And I didn't, I didn't want to paint on the rust, on the metal, because it's freaking metal focus you fuck and these two pieces are they look like they're different colors because that's metal anyway I got my little light working I trim black that um, I just put him back in there I like it what do you guys think I'm trying to get out of the light yeah anyway We got the the blue blue radio my knob fell off and that pissed me off now I got a bottle cap on there then I got the blue down here and this little uh, this little voltmeter 14.4 we got a charging point We gotta switch. Hey, the switch don't do nothing. So, next project. I need them door panels and the dashboard. So, I'm about to head out of here. Go return that can of spray paint. Get the other can. I'm gonna go to Harbor Freight. I'm gonna go to Harbor Freight first, and then I might go do that. I don't know. I'm gonna go to Harbor Freight. Look at the trailer hitches, cause I want that. Uh, I want that freaking drop down guy. Anyway, so I'm gonna get out of here, and I'll let y'all know what I'm doing later.